Hey guys, Harrison here. And if you've ever wished that you didn't have to use your phone to post to Instagram, then you're not alone. Lucky for us though, there is a pretty sneaky way that we can post to Instagram from our computer or our laptop. So let's jump over to my computer and I'll show you how it's done. All right, so what we're doing today is actually really easy. We're just gonna first open up Google Chrome. I would stick with Google Chrome. Uh, you can maybe try it with Firefox or Safari if you want, but I can only say that this is confirmed to work with Google Chrome. But from here, you just wanna go to uh, Instagram. So now that we're on Instagram and we've all logged in, we're gonna open up the developer tools in Chrome. It might look a bit scary at first, but it's not that bad. We're gonna go up here to these three dots, come down to more tools and then press on developer tools. And you'll see it's opened up this little panel here. Uh, if you're you know, a web developer, you're probably familiar with this. You can see this is all the uh, code for the page, but we don't need to touch any of this. It's all right. We're just gonna press right here, toggle device toolbar. And if you press that, you'll see that the website's changed for us. And it's actually up here, you can see it's simulating a pixel two viewing this page. So you can see we've got this little uh, little dot and it's if we click it's just like we're scrolling on a phone. If this hasn't come up for you you can just press up here and you'll see there's a whole lot of different options so we can simulate an iPhone X. We'll stick with the Pixel 2 though so if I just scroll this down a bit you'll see we're not getting what we're after this bar still up here. All we have to do though is reload the page and now what we can do you can see we've got this post button here now just like on the mobile app. If we press on that you'll see it opens up a dialogue. We can uh, choose the photo we want to upload and now we can just like on your phone you can edit it, change the cropping, move move it around or rotate it if you want. So you can see we can also apply a filter. I'm gonna skip that, I'll just press next. And you can see we can write a caption. So we can say something like, Bali rocks. We can add a location if you want, tag some people. I'm just gonna leave it like this. Maybe I'll put in a little uh, emoji. What can we do? We can do a rock. Mm, sure. That looks pretty cool. And now you can see if we just press share, so you can see now if you go back to your Instagram feed, the photo we posted is there just like it would be normally on your phone. And there you go, we've just posted a photo from our computer to our Instagram feed. Now, if you wanna get out of this mode, all you've gotta do is just close the uh, console down here. You can see it stayed like this, but if we reload the page, it'll be just like the normal computer Instagram again. But there you go, that's really all there is to it. I did tell you it would be pretty easy. And there you go, get posting. I hope, you know, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe down below. Also leave a comment and you are more than welcome to come follow my Instagram account as well. I'd love it if you could chuck it a follow. Apart from that though, thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next video.